Hello girls and boys. Now I'm just going to go through the various parts in our special performance for Education Week. Here is our very top line and that will be played with drumsticks or with djembies at different times in the performance. So let's just practice that one. Let's just count it out aloud. I'll count you in with four beats. One, two, three, four. One E and a two, three E and a four, one E and a two and three and four. So that's what it sounds like. So just let's do it again. And now we'll do it. I'll put a little timer on and we can count in time with that. Here we go. I'll count you in. One, two, three, four. One E and a two, three E and a four, one E and a two and three and four. And again, one E and a two, three E and a four, one E and a two and three and four. Now, let's have a look at the next one. This one is, of course, a djembe pattern. So we're just going to play this together in time with the music. Here we go. Let's just say it first. One, a two and three, a four and one, a two and three and four. Okay, so now let's try it with the tempo and I'll count you in. One, two, three, four. One, a two and three, a four and one, a two and three and four. Repeat. One, a two and three, a four and one, a two and three and four. Now let's have a look at the next one, which is the cowbell pattern. Let's just have a look at this and count it together. Here we go. <clears throat> one, two, three, four. One, two, and three, and four. Okay, so now, now let's play it. I'll count you in with four beats. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, and three, and four. Again, one, two, three, four. One, two, and three, and four. Okay. That was the cowbells. And now the claves. This is the very last pattern. And here's how it sounds. One, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, and four. Let's try it now. I'll just count it in. And you, you say it and play along too. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, and three, four, and one two and three and four again one two and three four and one two and three and four okay so now what we're going to do is play these rhythms you're going to play them and count them out aloud with me so i'll give some tempo and then you'll start playing through each one. So let's try the very first one now. Get ready to play maybe on, in, on, a, on a table or just on something at home, just so you can play along. Okay, here we go with the drumsticks and djembe pattern. Here we go. I'll count you in. One, two, three, four. One E and a two. Three E and a four. One E and a two and three and four. Repeat. One E and a two, three E and a four, one E and a two and three and four. Okay, now we're going down to the next one, which of course is the djembe pattern. Get ready to play, and I want you to count as you play it and say it with me. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One, a two, and three, a four, and one, a two, and three, and four. Repeat. One, a two, and three, a four, and one, a two, and three, and four. Now let's have a look at the cowbell part. That's the cowbells. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, 
three, four, one, two, and three, and four. Repeat. One, two, three, four, one, two, and three, and four. Now let's go down to the clave part. Once again, I want you to count it as you play it. Play it on anything you like that you've got at home. If you've got a djembe drum or two sticks, or even just play on the kitchen table. Anything. As long as you can see this, and you can count and play along. Here we go. I'll count you in. One, two, three, four. One, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, and four. Again, one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, and four. Okay, so those are all the parts of our performance. The top line, which would be djembis and drumsticks, will play played at different times. The second one, of course, is the djembi rhythm. The third one is the cowbells. The fourth one is the claves. We're going to combine all of these into our performance, which we'll do in our next lesson. Okay, so please practice all of these and have lots of fun doing it and see if you can memorize all these patterns. Well done, and I'll see you in the next class.